Hi guys, I'm just editing the vlog now and I could have sworn I filmed an intro, but I didn't. So, <laughs> this is not the glove up me, I swear. I'm just literally, I've not long woke up and I'm editing and I'm trying to get this out of the way. The outro is also like this, so I do apologize. I swear the in bits, the middle bits is me actually blowing up. But yeah, so, this vlog is basically me getting my nails done, lashes, Botox, hair, extensions, everything. I had a bit of a vain month, but I do apologize looking like this. We're not gonna talk about that. This is gonna be the intro because stupid ass me didn't film an intro before everything. So don't forget to subscribe, comment, uh, give a video a thumbs up, all of the above. You know what to do guys. Follow me over on Instagram and TikTok. It is just Jessica Jessica Ep. My favourite thing about coming to get my eyebrows done is in like this little remote village called Dunchurch and just look at like the houses and stuff. It's like, it's giving me like Lord of the Rings, Lord of the Rings vibes? Or is it Hobbit vibes or something like that? But yeah, I absolutely love it. Like the, the pubs and stuff around here are like so old fashioned. It's, oh my God, I'm right next to a bee's nest. It's like really like going back in time. Absolutely love it. Right, let's go get these eyebrows done. bad angle for me my face <laughs> so guys my eyebrows are done i actually love them when they're freshly done i'd even prefer them to stay like this i absolutely love them when they're like this so i'm going to link her details below anyway and i'll put it on the screen here for her instagram and stuff oh my screen is really foggy yeah so you can go and follow her and get your eyebrows done i absolutely love them they're darker at first and then they like scab and come off and peel and all of that and then they go lighter but i actually love them like this and they, i think they match my roots as well i actually love them like this sorry my thing's really foggy my camera's fogged up so i'm just gonna see if jade is still at the salon now to go get my botox top up i get my forehead crow's feet and bunny lines and if she's not i'll do it another day but i'll still film it anyway and then I've got to get my lasers on in a bit. But I actually need to eat because I haven't eaten yet. And it's now quarter past 11. So I'm starving. Why is your bars again like that? You can roll it quickly with a hand and put it in the there. Lovely. Bars Yeah. Your experience in brain couch, you're basically put in. So I had my laser done today on my armpits. I think there's some clips anyway that I've showed you. My armpits and my Hollywood, like Hollywood bikini line, whatever you want to call it down there. So I had mine done and then I did a girl that we know, Beth, my sister's friend. Um, she's so lovely. So we did hers. I had to do some filming for the company who I do the training with and stuff. So yeah so that was really fun and i'm really excited to see what the results after the second session will be like because obviously i i train in this laser now so it's it's really important that i know the brand and i know what the laser can do so that's why i'm really keen on having it done myself and the first after the first session i felt like the hair didn't grow back that fast i went from shaving every couple like every couple of days to like once a week i didn't feel like i needed to shave all the time which was really bizarre actually so now i'm excited to see after two sessions what the 
hair growth will be like back, that how fast it will be. I'm really, really interested. So I'll keep you all updated on that anyway. And also let me know if you want like more, I know I do obviously the clothing and beauty and cabin crew stuff, but let me know if you want more like life sort of vlogs like this, like what I do in a day or, you know, just more like me outside of work or not even like, I mean, I got away from cabin crew because obviously cabin crew vlogs are separate and all my videos to do with cabin crew are separate. But if you're interested in more like my other side of life, like what I do with my business and what I do day to day, my fitness and all of that, because there's so much other things that I've got going on as well at the moment. If you're really interested in that, let me know because I'll do more like monthly monthly live vlog videos or something or I'll fig figure out something to call it. You know, I can show you along, like do some vlogs at the salon do some vlogs like you know at the gym and around everything else so yeah let me know if that interests you but today is Saturday night I've got work tomorrow but not till like 3 p.m I've just got a glass of wine so I was going to show you the wine but I don't even see it I've got a glass of wine me and my stepdad are just ordering in some food and I'm just gonna watch a film I think or maybe I'll watch Maths Australia I'm so obsessed with like the new season of Maths Australia at the moment I watched like the last couple of seasons of the UK one and then I watched like the recent season of the Australian one and oh my god, it's just crazy, it's so crazy. But yeah, I, need, I really need to do a lot of editing, so maybe at some point I'll, I might just edit on standby tomorrow, start editing this if I don't get called, or maybe do a bit tonight, but I'm so tired if I'm honest, I'll probably just have an early night tonight. But yeah, that's my fun Saturday night, but I've had such a little pamper day, so I'm so happy. My brows look so good. Like, I honestly wish they could kind of look like this all the time, because they will go lighter than this eventually. Like, they'll sort of scab up and then go lighter, but I actually love them like this. I would keep them like this if I could. But yeah, so that's me. But anyway, anyway, I will see you at the next treatment. <laughs> Hi guys, so I've got no makeup on. Oh, rash is rashing. But I actually found out what it was. I went to the doctors this morning and they gave me some paperwork. Like I'm on antibiotics and some cream. They said it's perioral dermatitis. And basically people who have got like other skin conditions, like I've got psoriasis. I don't think you need a skin condition to have it, but they've said it probably might have just triggered it. And it's basically like sometimes it's round the mouth and it's just a bit of like inflammation. They say it's round the mouth and eyes and I've just got it here. But they put me on antibiotics for two weeks and some antibiotic gel cream thing. So hopefully that's going to go quite quickly because it's kind of making me feel... I know it sounds silly but like we are all vain to a degree aren't we? I mean I'm doing a flipping glow up vlog right now so I guess yeah. <laughs> I usually have really good skin so and I don't like to wear makeup if I don't need to so I just don't really feel comfortable not wearing makeup when my skin looks like this. I didn't film while I was in there I seen my friend in the nail salon and I was chatting to her and I was trying to catch up on emails and stuff so I didn't really film in the nail salon plus it was really busy and I don't really know if people like I don't want to film people if I you know they probably don't want to be filmed and stuff but I got my nails done so this is how I usually just get my nails like an ombre like a natural almond shape and just have them quite a little bit longer not too long but a little bit longer just because I feel like with longer nails I feel a bit more feminine I feel like they make my fingers look skinnier and I don't know I just like the look of having long feminine nails so I got these done and I also got my toes done okay so right what I've started doing I always get a pedicure I probably get my nails done every two weeks and then I'll probably get my pedicure about once a month just because I don't feel like the maintenance is as high on, on toes I don't know what I did the last time I went is they put acrylic on my big toes because they were like I think they were like chipped at the side and stuff like that and then I just had normal pedicure on my other toes which I get like gel French but my other toe now started like chipping and snapping and I think it's because like I go to the gym a lot I do a lot of workout I'm in heels a lot because of work and just personal life so I was like you know what I, I never understood why people got acrylic on their feet but actually I'm one of them people now so now I've decided to get acrylics on my feet to just keep them in check for longer so they don't 
break because they always do break. So I'm going to show you my feet. Oh, I don't really feel comfortable showing my feet on camera. And also I've got a lot of scarring on my feet at the moment because I got these new um, sandals and they just ripped my feet apart. So excuse if my um, feet look a bit manky. Basically, I've got acrylics on my toes. I've got, I've just had socks on, by the way. So this is what, this is all the scarring I've got. But yeah, basically got acrylic on my toes. Just French, and I don't know why the lighting is so bad. I don't like my feet, so that's actually quite like a big thing for me to put my feet on camera. <laughs> I don't like my feet at all. If I could have surgery on my feet, I would. I actually would, I'd be that person. But anyway, I'm, pro I'm gonna book in for lashes as well with my friend Sue, probably next week. They're not that bad actually at the moment. She's done a really good job. They don't re they're not desperate for an infill. But I'm gonna get an infill and this was Russian, but I think I might get Russian mixed with Russian volume. So I'm gonna book in with her next week. I'll leave her details as well, GMD Lashes. It's my friend who I've known basically forever and she does my lashes for me. Um, she's amazing. I've sent so many girls her way because she she is really good at what she does. So I'll leave her details as well. What else? Oh, my eyebrows as well. A lot of the scabbing has came off now and they look a lot more natural. However, I always love them when they first come out and they're like, but like really bold and that I love them. I, I wouldn't even mind if they stayed like that, but they're starting to look more natural now. And it's basically just having full natural eyebrows without having to draw them on or anything it's just so much easier so that is my eyebrows all done i would say there's probably only a tiny bit more healing left to do but they're pretty much healed and they healed literally in less than a week i think even quicker than they did last time to be fair sorry i'm like just burping and talking on the camera that's so gross yeah so i'm just literally having an admin day i was supposed to be at the salon today but the machine had to go in for service and they buggered up the day so i had to move my clients around so I'm having an admin day, I've just, because obviously I didn't book anything in today because I was booked up for work, I'm just literally catching up with so much admin stuff, social media stuff, my business stuff, advertisement stuff, collabs, um, I need to book a holiday, I need to sort my 30th, I need to go through all my emails, there's oh, so much, so much, so much, but I love being busy, I'm really happy, really happy where I am. So yeah, that is pretty much it. And I'm going to charge the camera up and we'll go in Mexico City tomorrow. So I'll be filming some more of my cabin crew vlog that will probably have been out before this. But yeah, that is me. So good afternoon. I am, I've just been to the gym actually. I've just done some weights. I've done a spin class and I've just walked for like 40 minutes on the treadmill. So actually, I think my activity should be quite high on here. Yeah, I'm over 8,134 8, steps so far. So it's because I know all afternoon I'm going to be basically sitting down for like hours because I'm actually going to get my hair done now. So this is my natural colour by the way. This is all my roots now. My roots will probably go back to about here. So I'm just going to get balayage. I don't get my roots done anymore just because my natural hair colour is darker. So as you can see like the contrast. So I'm just going to get balayage done on my ends. But I'll get them like right done here, like so just, just a little bit of root. And then I'm gonna get it cut because I need my hair to just make sure it's fresh and no dead ends. Uh maybe an Olaplex treatment. We'll see. We'll see um if it needs it or not. It's quite soft at the moment, actually. My hair's actually in quite good condition. I bought a new brush. The one I think I did it in one of my cabin crew vlogs. This I got it in America. The Knock Doctor. And it's like really quite soft bristle. And the reason I got that is because I'm actually getting hair extensions, which I think I've mentioned already in this vlog. Tomorrow I've got my colour match. So, excuse me. So I'm getting my hair dyed cut today. Tomorrow I'm going to get my colour match. And then next week I'm getting my extensions fitted, which I've never had extensions in my life before. So I'm kind of nervous. Really kind of nervous because I suppose I hear horror stories. But yeah. So I don't know. Abby's been doing my hair now for maybe a couple of years. Maybe like two, three years now. My hair was jet black box dye when I first met her. And she's got me 
basically fully blonde <laughs> and I actually think I do prefer being blonde the only thing I do miss about my hair being black was it used to grow like there was no tomorrow it would grow so fast it was so thick and curly and long like it was literally down to like my bum and my hair doesn't really grow as well being blonde but I do think that it looks a bit more mature blonde and I feel like I don't know I think that maybe blonde suits me a bit more quite a lot of people have said they prefer me blonde so yeah I'm gonna do that I'll bring my camera with me hopefully I don't get camera shy hopefully it's like quiet in there I hate getting my camera if not I might just film on my phone and do like little sneakies little sneaky clips but yeah so see you in the salon Sorry, so I didn't film much in there, but look how blonde I am. Oh my God, I'm literally so blonde now. I keep a little bit of root just because I do like a little bit of root. I can't believe how blonde I actually am. Like I went from jet black hair, I've been going to Abbey for a few years now. And literally we were just saying like I had jet black hair. You can sort of still see a tiny bit on the end. Oh no, no I think it's the lighting. But yeah, it's so weird to be fully blonde now. But yeah, it only took two hours actually. It was quite quick. I've got a mint in my mouth, sorry. But I'm going to go back home now. And yeah, I don't know what I'm going to do for the rest of the day. Hmm, maybe gym. But then I don't really want to go to the gym with fresh, clean hair. I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. Hmm. Oh, okay. So I got my lashes done by my friend Grace. I think these are the Russian, but I also got a little mix of like Russian volume in them as well. But my eyes are a little bit red at the moment just because my eyes get a bit sore with getting my lashes done. But I'm about to go and get hair extensions, so I'm going to actually vlog it a little bit as well. But I'm actually so excited. I've never seen my hair with long blonde hair. This is like, I just had it cut the other day because um, I had it dyed as well. But this is it with like no extensions in. Whereas when I had my hair black, when my hair used to be black, it was down to my bum it was so thick and curly but since bleaching it obviously bleach does damage your hair my hair is actually in great condition at the moment but my hair doesn't grow anywhere as near as it used to and it's not as thick as it used to be so i'm really excited to go and get hair extensions by the way i wouldn't i'd never regret going blondes like i'm not saying oh my god i went blondes and my hair ruined it didn't it just doesn't grow like it used to, but that probably is age and hormones and all of that as well. But I've never seen myself with long blonde hair, so I'm so, 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 so excited. So it's actually Beauty Works hair extensions. Hopefully get some really good content, and yeah, I'm really excited. I'm really, really, really excited. So yeah, I'm gonna take you with me, and yeah, my lashes are fresh as well, so I'm so happy. I've just booked a holiday to Morocco on the 12th as well, so I'm gonna have fresh lashes, flash, fr ugh, fresh lashes, fresh hair, fresh everything, Botox, still in check like Botox is literally great so yeah amazing I can't wait want to get it sort of curly as well. I'm gonna get you to hold that. Are you? Oh, it's recording already. Sort of show the back. Okay, let me. Do you? Can I put the camera down? Yeah, yeah, if you want. Yeah, yeah, that's probably easy for you. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Just so everyone can see. Oh my god, I love it! Yay! Yay! Ah! Yay! <laughs> I'm so he does, he looks so nice. He oh, really thank does. you. Hi guys, so I'm just closing the vlog. I, <laughs> I know I look like this, but I feel like, you know, we keep it real on this channel. I'm not, I'm not Instagram Jess on this channel, I'm the real Jess. <laughs> but basically, yeah, sorry, I did my hair last night. By the way, I've bought the Dyson Airwrap, so I'm thinking of, like, 
I'm gonna try and do some like TikToks and maybe some YouTube videos and stuff like that. But basically, anyway, I'm getting sidetracked. I'm just editing the vlog now, so I just wanted to close it off for you guys. By the way, look, my perioral dermatitis is gone, but it's a little bit still fading. It has been probably a month since I filmed this vlog. I'm just getting around to editing it now. I'm just failing at YouTube, guys. I'm just, honestly, if you all unsubscribe to me now, I wouldn't even blame you because, because I'm just being a crap YouTuber right now. I'm like, I don't class myself as an influencer, but other people do and I'm probably the worst one in the world. <laughs> so anyway, I'm just closing the vlog here, guys. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. If you want to, please subscribe. I am going to get back into it. I know I keep saying that, but I really do need to get back into it. I'm going to do a whole new vision board and everything and just, you know, knuckle down on Instagram and YouTube. But yeah, let me know what you want to see next. Do you like these kind of vlogs? Because maybe if you like these kind of vlogs, I could do like weekly vlogs or monthly vlogs of just like what I get up to, blah, blah, blah. But anyway, yeah, don't forget to comment. And yeah, follow me over on Instagram and TikTok. It is just Jessica Jessica X. Bye guys, have a beautiful time.